Relations between ASEAN and Australia have never been stronger. They've grown closer and closer since Australia became ASEAN's first dialogue partner in 1974. We're neighbours and we're connected by deep links across communities, trade and education. Australia strongly supports ASEAN centrality. We see ASEAN at the heart of the Indo-Pacific. Our cooperation spans ASEAN's three pillars, ranging from promoting safe labour migration in ASEAN to supporting implementation of RCEP and ANSFDA to combating transnational crime. Australia backs ASEAN priorities. Our development cooperation supports ASEAN policy on connectivity, the fourth industrial revolution and narrowing the development gap. COVID-19 has challenged us all. Nobody will be safe until we are all safe. That's why we've stepped up cooperation. In June, we announced programs to support ASEAN to bolster health security, stability and recovery, including a new health security initiative. In September, we launched another package, including $1 million for ASEAN's COVID-19 response fund and support for the Mekong on early detection of COVID-19. In October, Australia made a $500 million commitment to support vaccine access for the Pacific and Southeast Asia, with $21 million for the ASEAN Centre for Public Health Emergencies and Emerging Diseases. And in November, we announced over $500 million in new economic, development and security measures for Southeast Asia. These packages are aligned with ASEAN's priorities, including the ASEAN outlook on the Indo-Pacific, they're an investment in the future of the region and our relations with ASEAN. As we navigate the road ahead, Australia will be with ASEAN every step of the way.